Hello, and here I am in a little trade with the FSO harmonic scanner. And this is a nice example for a perfect um, pattern. And the alert for the Euro Swissy in this case on the H1 came a first time around here. And I did uh, or I took the trade, um, as you can see here, with the Metacrit Trade Manager. And uh, this is the target here I placed. This is the original calculated target, but I used this one because I think here uh, we could face a little bit resistance. So I would be happy if price comes until here. And now trailer is already behind price. You can see this is the white line. Now you can see how the trailer of the Metacrit works. And then I explain you why I took this uh, trade today and trailer I said uh, starting uh, at 10 pips movement and then it trails five, uh, five pips behind the price. And every time when price uh, moves further, then it will uh, stay five pips behind. And if uh, the price goes deeper as our trailer, then all trades will be closed. And you can see trade closed because of stop loss. Stop loss means in this case trailer. So now we banked our uh, profit. Uh, from this trade and let's have a look what we made here um, this was a, a trade I took earlier today it was also a winner with the FSO harmonic scanner as you can see on the uh, dollar yen and uh, this was our euro swissy trade here with this four uh, uh, trades uh, this was the um, let me see the initial trade here and then this three scale ins and uh, now I explain you why I took uh, this trade. Then you can see um, how you can um, manage these trades or uh, to see what is a good or, or a bad trade. Um, this is our pattern here. And as I said, um, I guess around about here, the first um, alert came for a, a bullish butterfly. Um, this is the pattern we see here and you can see it says here bullish uh, butterfly uh, but I took it not um, on the first alert and you should not do this too uh, you should wait and wait for confluence or some signs that this entry is really uh, working out and um, as you can see we are here in a very strong support area this is this big um, black line and uh, like Dennis uh, explained on his his FSO scanner videos. This line and this line are very strong market maker lines. These are quarter lines. And I like if uh, the entry is round about uh, this area, then normally we see very often that the price goes a little bit deeper, uh, higher, deeper, higher, and then again it moves away from such a strong area. And this was the first uh, point why I took this uh, trade, but I waited. Uh, what I want to see is a W formation, um, a V, uh, a W um, pattern. And um, you can see here is my TDI um, indicator. And a W, um, I try to paint it here in. You can, oh, just a moment. I have to change the paintings here. So now I'll try again. We have here our price moved here down. You can see it. Then it was going a little bit up. Then again down and then up. And you can see this is a W formation. And this um, pattern you can see very often on all time frames. And it works very nice on the H1, for example. And um, if you look on the TDI indicator, you can see this W forming as well. Here you can see it was going down, then we get this little bit up, then here this down. And this looks already like a W is forming. And this was the reason why I took uh, this trade around about here. It went a little bit higher, then you can see like here, uh, it looks uh, more and more like a W and then you can see, yeah, it is a W and maybe it will go further. But I uh, used in this way a trailer. Um, for a little scalping trade, we could also wait until maybe it reached our uh, target. Um, but this is the, the W formation, which I like very much. And if you see such a pattern, 
um, on a, so, a such a strong level with um, a bullish butterfly, for example, then you can uh, take this trade and uh, confluence here the Renko street indicator um, switched to green on this area and this was the third point why I took this trade so it was first this strong support area then I waited to see a W formation uh, like Dennis explains in his last FSO 7 video and um, you can't wait until the W is completely formed. Um, it's a little bit guesswork at the end, but if you see here on the TDI, uh, t uh, W um, shape is forming, and you can see here this W begins to form, then you can uh, go in the trade if such a strong candle forms, and I took the trade uh, halfway of this candle, and then we you saw it, uh, could take some pips out of this trade. And um, this is what why you wait uh, should wait for um, confluences on the harmonic trading. Wait for more than one reason to go into a trade, and wait for the confluences. And you need patience with harmonic trading. You can't take every uh, entry and alert the FSO scanner gives. You have to wait until more than one reason appears to go into the trade. Happy trading. <laughs>